Chapter 11 bankruptcy provides an opportunity to reorganize one's debts and for business with severe financial problems to stay in business. There are three different types of Chapter 11 bankruptcy. The first and most well-known type is Chapter 11 for large corporations. The second and most common type of Chapter 11 bankruptcy is for small businesses. A small business is defined as one with less than 500 employees and less than $2.19 million in debt. The third and by far the most unusual Chapter 11 is for individuals who do not qualify for Chapter 7 or Chapter 13 bankruptcy. An individual filing Chapter 11 is given five years to repay all or depending upon the circumstances part of the debt owed. A business may be given in excess of five years to repay its debts. There are many benefits to Chapter 11 bankruptcy. In the Chapter 11, the court may reduce the amount owed on secured property if the amount owed is in excess of the property's value. For example, if you own a building that has a mortgage of $5 million and the fair market value of the building is only $3 million, the court may reduce the mortgage to $3 million. The $2 million that was removed from the mortgage becomes an unsecured debt and is paid along with other unsecured debt over the life of the plan. Depending upon the facts of the case, unsecured debts may be reduced, sometimes significantly. If the Chapter 11 payment plans states that the unsecured creditors are to be paid 10% over five years, that will result in the $2 million that came off the mortgage in our example being reduced to $200,000. The $200,000 would be paid along with other unsecured debts over the repayment period which is often five years. As in other types of bankruptcies, there is an automatic stay that goes into effect when the Chapter 11 is filed with the bankruptcy court. This prevents creditors from taking collection or legal actions against the debtor while the bankruptcy is pending. The court may also allow a debtor to obtain new financing under better terms by allowing a new creditor priority over prior creditors to the business's earnings. The court may allow the debtor to reject and cancel contracts. Although a Chapter 11 bankruptcy may provide much relief and even allow a failing business to continue, it takes much effort and expenses. There's a great deal of paperwork that is needed in order to have a Chapter 11 bankruptcy approved. Complete bank records for the previous several years are required. In addition, financial statements and profit and loss statements are a must. During the time the plan is in effect, financial reports will be required every month. There will be oversight by the court during the time that the Chapter 11 is active. Even the most basic Chapter 11 may cost thirty dollars to $50,000 in legal and accounting expenses. My name is Jeffrey Peltz. I invite you to look through our website for more information on bankruptcy in our law firm. When you're ready for more information, call us toll-free at 855-625-0800 to schedule a free consultation.